OMG BBG! Welcome to another epic BBG video. Today's video is about competitive tournament play. So the World Beyblade Organization hosts many different tournaments throughout the year, and there are different formats that you can participate in, with the newest being Burst GT format. That's right. K from WBO reached out to us and wanted to collaborate, so we're here to share with you what this new Burst GT format is all about. It's pretty exciting. So first things first, the ban list. What are you allowed to use and what you're not allowed to use? As the name suggests, Burst GT format, you can use most of the parts up to Season 4. Which means Super King sparking layers are not allowed. All DB and BU layers are also not allowed. Similarly, for the Forge Discs, all Super King sparking and Dynamite Battle System Forge Discs are not allowed. All Super King slash Sparking System double chassis parts are not allowed as well. All these newer parts are banned. They're restricting a number of parts to maintain a healthy metagame. Now what makes Burst GT special as a limited format is that Hasbro collectors can now compete as well. Up until now it's been years since Hasbro collectors can actually compete together with Takeratomi collectors because of the releases from Hasbro. Many of the Hasbro Pro Series releases were from the GT era. Making this format accessible for both Hasbro and Takeratomi players. Yeah, it's pretty cool because up until now, we haven't really found much use of the Pro Series parts. But now we can actually use those Pro Series parts in competitive play with this format. So yeah, if you only have Pro Series stuff, you can still join an official WBO tournament. WBO will also be legalizing the Pro Series Stadium for WBO tournaments. If you use the Pro Series Stadium mainly, you're going to feel right at home at these Burst GT tournaments. So if you're just about to start collecting Beyblades and you're looking to buy some Hasbro products, then which one should you start out with? We actually unboxed quite a few Pro Series products lately. I remember Command Dragon was such a good release. Perfect Phoenix is of course another great release from Pro Series. And then Judgment Joker, the signature super offensive rubber. These are just a few that you can start collecting that are very competitive right out of the box. With that all said, here's 5 recommended combos from WBO that you can use with the Burst GT format. With this Burst GT format, I'm super curious what bladers will come up with. The first combo we have here is Judgment Achilles Zero Lift Quick Dash Goku. These combos were created with Pro Series and Takeratomi parts. You can get a lot of these parts from the Pro Series releases too. The second bait we have here is Lightning El Drago Blitz Extreme Dash. Man, I haven't seen El Drago in so long. It's interesting to see it in this list. Yeah, especially as a competitive combo too. It'll be really nice for those of you who want to experiment with this format and you can whip out your older Takeratomi parts or use a Pro Series part. Third bay we have here is Master Longness Wheel Extend Plus. Fourth bay is Imperial Pegasus Double Zero Expand Destroy Dash. You can of course use the Command part from the Pro Series release of Command Dragon. And the fifth bay we have here is Perfect Phoenix from our Pro Series including our Takeratomi level chip and Ignition Dash. So what do you guys think of these parts from the WBO? What other combos do you guys think you would come up with? Alrighty, so now that you know a little bit more about the Burst GT format, we're gonna do some test battles using these combos from the World Beyblade Organization. Battle time. Three, two, one. Let's go. So I have that Master Longus. Let's go! Bursted Command Pegasus. Okay, this bay, this combo right here, with Master Longinus, feels like really tiny, really small and everything, but it's a solid pick for sure. Decent. And feels really spinning, good launching. Because it's uh, using, it's utilizing Longinus, you know? Yep. That felt good. I'm gonna keep on using Master Longinus until I lose. Okay, the loser swap, I'm gonna use my El Drago. Three, Three two, one. one. So fast. Such a small combo, but very quick. Okay, I'm gonna use the Judgment Achilles combo now. Three, Three two, one. one. Oh, that jump, bro. Holy, that was sick. You know, it's kinda nice to use these lighter bays sometimes. Yeah. Swap it out, you know. 
So it's quick cool. dash versus extreme dash right now for the drivers. Ooh. No! Lightning El Drago yeah. so strong. It's like when they got so used to all the new DB BU bays, these are uh, kind of refreshing. All right, perfect Phoenix, man, with ignition dash. There's no way I can lose this one, right? I don't know about that. Come on, come on, come on. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Goodness. You didn't even have a chance to uh, <laughs> use your electric driver. Dude, I need a rematch right now. I need a rematch. Three, two, one. Oh. What a comeback. Just goes to show that you can beat the electric drivers with like an initial attack. You can, but now you fast. rejuvenated. Yeah. Oh, look at that oh. combo. Oh. Pretty impressed by the Lightning El Drago combo. Same. Yeah, well, this one, obviously, Ignition Dash, not released in Pro Series. I really wish it did. Hopefully, we'll see it in the future. Now, remember, the Pro Series Stadium is legal in the Burst GT format. Same as the standard type base stadium from Takeru Tomi. So, let's just switch it up. Three, Three two, two, one. Oh, oh my god. Yo, <laughs> oh, it's so hard. <laughs> Legit. Sick. Oh. No! Master Longinus. Destroyed. Judgment Achilles. Three, two, one. Three. Oh, two heavyweights. Oh. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> you had the top piece of Command Dragon, and I have the bottom piece of Command Dragon. Yeah. <laughs> look, at this, look at the single. It's so funny looking. <laughs> it looks so funny. Perfect Phoenix, such a good bay right out of the box. So that's an overview on the Burst GT format for future WBO tournaments. Hopefully that gave you an idea of what parts and bays and combos you can create. Now do keep in mind that there are other tournament regulations that you need to follow. So make sure you check out worldbeyblade.org and go follow their Discord too for more tournament information. So yeah, if you're into competitive play, hopefully you enjoy this format and join the conversation on WBO. Let us know down in the comment section what you think of this brand new format and what combos you come up with. As always, Geeks out!